Uh, and we're here today, like black and brown solidarity. So, so excited to see all you people out here um, during this time. Uh, we're gonna start out with a land acknowledgement before we introduce ourselves and before we um, introduce the program. We're so excited that the Bikes, Birds, and Environmental Justice event is being hosted by Environmentalists of Color, Equity City, and Organic Oneness. We could have not done this alone. What we're doing today is a black and brown solidarity ride to explore healing and justice in North Lawndale, which is a predominantly black neighborhood, and Little Village, which is a predominantly brown neighborhood. We want to bring these neighborhoods together and while doing that also uh, really explore nature um, and how we want to heal our planet, um, uh, the activity of cycling and increased mobility in our neighborhoods. I actually stumbled in up on it. I came and dropped my daughter off and thought that I was just going to do the parent thing and sit in the car and wait for her. But once I found out what it was about and about peace and, and unifying uh, brown, black, and indigenous. I thought that was just wonderful, and I wanted to be a part of it, so I jumped out the car and I joined in. Last year, I started going to like different bird walks, but all of those things were spaces dominated by white people, right? With money, and it was just a space that it was always welcoming, but. I would just always look around and there was many people who looked like me and my family. So it's nice to be a part of these groups who are trying to bring more diverse crowds into things like birding. It's in our history, it's in our everything, our songs, our books, our plays, our movies. Like, it's just part of who we are, right? Like, it's how we relate to the planet or whatever. People came from all over Chicago. We had over a hundred people. We had a lot of wonderful energy, love and unity on this ride, community building. And so that's what we hope people walk away with is a new friend, a new ally, a new person. Also being re-energized to keep promoting social justice, equity, and, and helping us figure out how to change policies to help our communities. Anybody within the sound of my voice, Let's be real about something. The, the root cause of all injustice experienced by black, brown, and indigenous people in our society is structural racism. Our oppression was and is by design. The most important work we must do is the dismantling of structural racism and the building of a society where black, brown, and indigenous people thrive. Let's ride. 